What's up Aors Mobile family? I'm Charlie. We've been talking about the Trifold's 10-inch screen for days. But the latest report we have suggests this device will remain a secret, not for the fans, but for Samsung itself. While Samsung was scrambling to produce hundreds of thousands of Fold 7 units, it's limiting the Trifold to just 20,000 to 30,000 units. This is an incredibly low figure. Why is Samsung taking such a risk? What is the real reason behind the leak that they will skip the US market? If you're ready, let's analyze the market misfortune and fear behind this ultra-limited tri-fold strategy. The most critical information leaked from Korean sources. Samsung will only order components for around 20,000 to 30,000 Galaxy Z tri-fold units. This is the lowest production number we've ever seen for a Samsung flagship launch. They were forced to order 260,000 extra units of the Fold 7. Now, we're talking about less than a tenth of that for the pinnacle of technology. Supplier hesitation. Reports indicate that even suppliers are hesitant to believe more orders will come. This proves the Trifold is positioned as an experimental product, not a global one. Skipping the US market and the $2,500 hurdle rumors that the Trifold will skip the US market are no longer surprising, especially combined with the low production volume. The core reason is pricing. The device is estimated to exceed $2,500. Samsung doesn't want to risk this expensive and experimental product in the high expectation US market. Analysts predict Samsung will use this low volume for a test drive only in Asian markets, Korea, China. The goal is to gauge performance and observe potential first-generation issues within a small audience. This is a cautious but weak strategy for a technology leader. Design repetition and the usability reality. Despite the 10-inch screen and G-shaped fold, the Trifold's design details are disappointing. Recent leaked videos showed the device with a design quite similar to the Fold 7. Usability issues. The noticeable thick bezels and the nearly identical camera housing to the Fold. 7 suggests the device will feel less like an ultra premium product and more like a complex prototype. Samsung likely spent all its engineering resources on the triple hinge technology and postponed cosmetic improvements. So yes, while the Galaxy Z Trifold is an incredible feat of engineering, Samsung's 20,000 to 30,000 unit limit is a signal of fear and caution. Samsung wants to run just a test, rather than change the mobile world with this device. Do you think skipping the US with this $2,800 device is a loss for Samsung? Or? Is this a clever retreat necessary before Apple's 2026 foldable attack? Let's discuss it in the comments. To avoid missing all the upcoming news about this limited edition device, subscribe to the Aors Mobile family now. See you in the next analysis.